My name is Rita Dedeke from Berlin, Germany. I'm here to testify of the goodness of God in my life and in that of my family. In February this year, I gave birth to my son. After the delivery, we were asked to stay in the hospital for normal checkups. And then after the checkups, the pediatrician noticed that my son's scrotum doesn't have a testis in it. It only has one. And then she said that the child would not be able to um, reproduce in the future if nothing is done that maybe they will have to do a surgery or something and i went home without bothering or thinking about it because i know that there's no way i will be on a prayer altar and i'll be praying about it and my son will not go any surgery so i did not pay attention to it every time reverend prays about healing and restoration or when we put a, a mantle on our head i used my mantle and i placed it on my son's um, private areas and few days till when the doctor has said okay this is the last checkup after this i'm going to have a surgery done i went to the doctor i noticed that everything the two testes were normal and I had to go to the hospital on the 24th and so when we went to the hospital the doctor saw it and she didn't say anything so I had to talk to her and I asked her this is my son is everything okay now even though I knew everything was fine I just wanted her to confirm that everything is okay as well and then she said yes everything is fine and my son's so calm about it but it's indeed a very big testimony for me and my family because what will i be doing the surgery for a six months old for i don't even know the kind of surgery that would be i don't even i've never heard of it before that kind of surgery before so i don't even know what it would have what would have happened but god saved me and bestowed everything so i'm here to return all glory to god and i'm here to say indeed with our god all things are possible and there is nothing that you put in the hands of god that will go bad if you're believing god for anything just keep on praying even if you don't see it now, it will eventually, it will definitely happen because God is not the God that takes from you and doesn't give give you back in return. He even gives us more than we can even think about. I will say thank you, Reverend Sam, Pastor Chego, Mama Mary, Oye. I want to say may the grace and blessings on this altar and the oil of God on this altar never run dry. Hallelujah. Amen. Let me specially invite you to join thousands from around the world from over 110 countries as we come together Monday to Friday to spend time in the presence of the God who has never failed us for over 1,200 days now. We've been praying every day. We've been seeing revivals, miracles, breakthroughs, open doors. It is simply beyond our imagination how God answers prayer. But one of the things we can tell you is that we are seeing miracles we are having testimonies every day from everywhere because you see when people pray they prevail and they prosper we know here that with our god all things are possible it will be a great honor and privilege for me to have you join us monday to friday 5 50 a.m west african time as we turn our attention to the only wise god the one with whom there's no shadow of turning. The God who answers prayer. Indeed, with him, all things are possible. Join us every day.